that would say again, it's very, very obvious. But for all those people out there who are teaching, uh, you know, the market of these is too. Just know that um, prior to, uh, you know, like I said, the rap, you like to take notes. And then the next, the first play. much uncertainty with that, you know, in the world, if we would ever get to that, we're like, you know, careful, good numbers of them, even just, like, let's just say, uh, see the beat, so to speak, we're all, good. we're all being microchips, like, how much uncertainty is that, the Bible is true, like, how much faith would you need in the Bible, if that was literally happening right before your eyes, like, I mean, at that point, what element of faith do you need, like, now we have some amount of faith, because you have subjects, you have, you have, you have all right, shalom, 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 brother Godal, go bar Yahweh to hit you with some more precepts. Um, y'all should know me as Great Warrior Judah. Okay, this is my um third channel. Okay, Great Warrior Judah, Gah. Okay, so first I'm gonna start off by giving all praise, honor, and glory due to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem, Ha, Rach Kodash. All praise to the Heavenly Father, who the world ignorantly calls God. In the name of his only begotten son, who the word ignorant called Jesus Christ, in the name of the Holy Spirit, double honors to the elder apostle, elder bishops of great millstone. Still well, peace and bless to the hopeful let. Shall I want, shall I want? So we have this, this, this dude who don't even, this dude named the mind of God, who don't even know what the scriptures say, man. Because the scriptures wasn't given to the heathen, man. Okay, the scriptures wasn't given to y'all, man. You're an Elamite, man. The scriptures wasn't given to you, and the Lord damn sure was, wasn't putting you in the steed fast of him as his prophets, man. Because what you just brought out has nothing to do with what, what's going to be going on. It has nothing to do with prophecy, man. The the axios, or the, yeah, the axios, which is the hands, has nothing to do with the Lord saying, um, that this dude gonna cause all both small and great rich and poor to receive a mark in their foreheads or in their hands, man. So what you just brought up has nothing to do with it. The name and the, the number of the beast is sixty-six, meaning um, um, six is an imperfect number, man. Okay, six is the uh, uh, the the day um, if I'm not mistaken, the day man was created, man, and that's why it's a number of a man because it's, this man is a devil, man. Okay, he's an in, imperfect um uh, devil. Okay. Okay, he got uh, DXOs with the right side or right hand or strong side. The Lord ain't saying that in the scriptures. He don't care about what side you get chipped on. Because right in, in Revelation 14, he tell you that if you get the mark of the beast or um, follow the image of the beast, okay, you will be destroyed, man. Okay, and it says that in the next chapter over, man. So what are you bringing out the right side, right hand, strong side? Has nothing to do with uh, with if you take the chip or not, man. I put down below. Uh, it's Karagma Same as Greek 5482 And that Greek 5482 If I'm not, talk, if I'm, if I'm not mistaken It's correct, man Meaning a, 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 a Dented point, man Or meaning a point That they're going to use To in, inject the chip in you, man Okay um, A scratch or itching I.e. stamp as a badge of servitude A sculpture figure Statue graving mark Then um, It's like you he probably took down y'all. Uh, I put up another one. I had put up another one, but I see I can't. Um, I see I can't find it. Uh, so let's let's go to the the blue letter, man. All right. It says a stamp, an imprint mark. Okay, this is the Karagma, man. Okay, this is the RFID chip. That you gotta get injected in you from a Karax, and that's the mark of the beast, man. That that means you're all for transhumanism, transhumanism, all for Esau Edom, which is the devil's society, man. That's sixty six society, that uh, uh, idolatry society, man. Okay. Uh, um, it says a stamp or imprint mark of the mark stamped on the forehead or the right hand as the badge of the followers of the uh, anti messiah. So is that going on? Does the hands have anything to do with on what side you getting a chip on? No, man. You can get it in your toes. You can get it in your legs. You can get it in your forehead. You can get it in your brain. You can get it in your neck, man. Like on, on Suicide Squad had, had made the video. Will Smith and them getting a chip in their neck. And it was a chip to blow them up. You know what I'm saying? If they 
win a, win a straight, man. Okay, if you ever watch Suicide Squad, okay. And also, if I'm not mistaken, it's a movie coming out talking about Implant. Talking about being chipped, man. Okay, 2022 is supposed to be when it's coming out. Okay, also, so so dude, what you brought out, DXO has nothing to do with what the Lord was saying in Revelation 13, man. It has nothing to do with that. So stop taking from the word. Stop adding to it. Alright, so lucky. Let me go. Um... You know, it don't matter where you get it at, man. If you get it. You'll get destroyed, man. Okay. Got a few. Deuteronomy 4 and 2. Ye shall not add unto the word which I command you. Neither shall ye diminish out on from it. So he's trying to. Um, he's with this new world order agenda. That mind of God, dude. Okay. He's with this new world agenda. He's an Elamite. He's with the agenda. He's the same one that helped Esau eat him oppress you, man. Elam helped Esau eat him oppress us, man. Okay. All right, you can read that in uh, uh, um, Psalms 83, man. And also, you can read Psalms 147. It says, uh, How be it I showed my uh, statutes and my judgments to J uh, a Jacob. Okay, and I'm paraphrasing, but he shall not, he have not dealt so with any nation. Praise ye the Lord. Okay, the Lord ain't dealt with any nation all throughout the scriptures. He ain't dealt with no other nation. He only rose up, brought up nations to put us in subjection to him. Because we was going off. That's the only time he ever dealt with you nations. Other than that, he don't give a damn about you nations, man. And that's all through the scriptures. He said, y'all spittle. said, y'all roke. Y'all are nothing, man. Okay? Diminish aught from it that ye may keep the commandments of the Lord your power, which I command you. So, hey, the Lord commanded us to keep the law, statutes, commandments. Not you heathen, man. Okay? He commanded us to follow him. Not you heathen, man. It says, Jeremiah 10 says, how uh, uh, fallen I in the way of the heathen, okay? And be not dismayed by the signs that are in heaven. You heathen, they do your Elamite. Your people worship the stars, man. Your people worship elephants and stuff, man. Okay? Revelation 22 and 18 through 19. For I testify unto you, every man that heareth the words of prophecy of this book, okay? If any man shall add unto these things, Yahweh shall add unto him the plagues that are written in this book. So, dude, you got the plagues coming towards you, man. You know, you got players coming towards you, man. In the name of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, man. Because cause you taking out from the word, man. You're adding on to it. You're trying to say that the hands have something to do with the... That has nothing to do with the RFID chip, man. <laughs> you know, and it's people just following and believing you, man. Okay, but it has nothing to do with the RFID chip, man. Yo, yeah, you, like I said before, you can put it in your hands. You still got to use an indented point to to pierce the skin. So you'll be breaking the uh, 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 the cutting of flesh in the Thawara, man. Okay, if I'm not mistaken, that's in the book of Leviticus, man. The cutting of the flesh, thou shalt not make cuttings in our flesh, man. So you have to cut through the flesh, okay, to get the the the, the Maxine or the um uh, um the RFID chip, man. But the the Maxine is just a prelude to the RFID chip, because even though he's mandating all over the world, it's still you can't put the damn Maxine in your forehead, man. Okay, so y'all people that follow this do need to think about that. Ain't nobody been putting the Maxine, the jab in her forehead. They've been putting it in their arm. Only their arm, man. And the scripture states that the RFID chip, you can either put it in the forehead or in the hands, man. And it really don't matter because over there in Sweden, them people putting it all over their bodies, man. Okay, so dude, you, you're adding and taking from the word. I mean, y'all bashing y'all shall destroy you, man. Because you're not a man of the Lord. You're, you're a healer who shouldn't even pick up the Bible, man. Okay, who shouldn't even be bringing out verses, man. Because you don't know what the hell you're talking about, man. Okay. And again, six is an imperfect number. We're we're, we're born on, on we was on uh, created on the sixth day, man. So we're imperfect. That's that's a six. The other one, um, the, the other six is really just showing you the um the ideology and uh, philosophy of this beast that it's talking about, man. Okay, it ain't you know what I'm saying. It ain't uh, 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 talking about uh, uh, Babylon the Great. Okay. It's talking about a, a nation of people that, that's going to enforce this thing on you, okay? And that nation of people is so-called white people, man, okay? You got you got the, the Rockefellers, 
the Duhans, and, and you know what I'm saying? Uh, 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 the Alpheimers, if I'm not mistaken, slunk you. Um, but you got all these f federal bankers who are Edomites, man. And guess what? These federal bankers want to chip you too, um, the mind of God. They want to chip you, man. Because <laughs> they already know you with their agenda. They, they can see it through, through your uh, YouTube, man. They can see what, what agenda you're running with, man. So DXO has nothing to do with the RFID chip, man. It has nothing at all to do with the RFID chip, man. All right, so if any man should take away from the words of the book of this prophecy, Yahweh shall take away his part out of the book of life, which the heathen have no 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 right to be in the book of life at all. So that, that's not that's not uh, directed towards you. That's directed towards the um, the Israelites who who be taken um, away from the words. Okay. Um, and out of the holy city and from the things which are written in this book, because the Israelites got their law statutes commands. The Israelites got their promises according to Romans nine, man. Okay. So let's let's go let's go back. Okay. And you got people asking, you know, I don't understand why you're completely ruling out the RFID chip being the mark of the beast. Will you please elaborate? And he he the dude He couldn't look, he said he causes all both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond to receive a mark in their diaxios or in their forehead. So again, the hands has nothing to do with it. You always trying to bring out the hands, man. Hey, but the hands is just another way for them to inject the mark of chip in you. The mark of the beast in you, man. The chip. Okay? And your forehead is another way for them injected in you. Okay? And then Karox is the etymology, which is the indented point, man. So again, you're leading people astray, man. Okay? Some of the right side or right hand or strong side. That has nothing to do. That's that's folly, man. <laughs> that is folly, dude. The Lord and the Lord don't care what side you get the mark of the beast. Okay? Hey, he gonna destroy you if you get it, man. <laughs> you know, and that's the point. Right? And that's the that's the whole for real, the whole point of me making this video. Stop lying, bruh. Stop adding to the word and stop lying, man. You heathen. Okay? So let, let's let's uh, let's go to that the blue letter so like here. Okay. So like you know, it kills us to always have to keep getting on you heathen because y'all think y'all know what the hell y'all talking about, man. And y'all don't. <laughs> Bugged out of your damn mind, man. Then it on down it says, and that no man might buy or sell, sell he that have the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name. That's all dealing with the same thing. The mark is dealing with the name of the beast. Dealing with the, the ideology of the beast, okay? Dealing, dealing, dealing with the so-called white man being him, him being your your master, man. Him being your your or head, okay? Your head in in this on this side, man. The one says, "Here is wisdom. Let him that have understanding count the number of the beast, for it is the number of a man, a nation of men, okay? And his number is six hundred three score and six, man, okay? Let's get there. All right, what is that? What is that 666? Um, key Zeke Stigma, okay? Strong's G5516. Chai Xai Stigma. Chai Xai Stigma. Chai Xai Stigma. Chai Xai Stigma, man. Part of speech, numeral. Etymology, Greek 2-2 two, two, or Greek 14. And uh, an absolute, uh, absolute letter. 4742 as a cross of the Greek alphabet intermediate between Greek 5 uh, th and Greek 6 th used as numbers. Okay. The Strong's Info. Um, intermediate between the 5th and 6th used as numbers um, de detonating, denoting Slanky. Slanky Israel. Denoting respectively, respectively, respectively. Um, six hundred sixty and six, sixty-six as a numeral. Six hundred three score and six, man. To six hundred and sixty-six, 
the meaning of which is basis of much vain speculation, man. Okay. All right. And what is the stigma from a um, primary to stick prick? A mark ins ins insists or punched for recognition of both ownership, i.e., figuratively scarf service mark. Like just like how hey, this mark of the beast. It ain't like the or it ain't like the um the jab, man. Okay, you're 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 you're, you're going to, uh, against being contrary to law when you get the jab as well. But the mark of the beast, which is the RFID chip. They're gonna use something to, they gonna use something to stick you with. And then they're gonna ins ins incision into you, man. Okay, for your badge of servitude, as it said. Um, a brand upon the body. Mark pricked in or brand upon the body to ancient oriental usage. Slaves and soldiers bore the name of the stamp of their master or commander, branded or pricked, cut into their bodies to indicate what master or general they belong to. Like a like a horse, when you brand your horse of your symbol, your brand on that horse. Hey, that horse is yours. The people that, that even see that horse I know that you had that horse's ownership, man. It's the same way in this age. You got Esau Edom trying to take ownership over you um vessels out there, man. You 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 just you bodies, man. Okay? Because uh the elect are not gonna get the mark of the beast, man. They ain't gonna get the jab, man. Okay, but again, the jab is a prelude to the mark of the beast, man. Cause hey, just because he's mandating the jab, hey, guess what? Uh 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 that should tell you spiritually that the market of the beast is right around the corner in all these other places. Um, you have people getting the, the, the mark of the beast. They, it's the mark of the beast, the RFID chip, man. You have people getting it in their right hand. Okay? That'd be the main place they put it, your right hand or your forehead, man. They ain't putting a jab in your hand or forehead. Okay? All right. Um, belong to the... And there were even some devotees who stamped themselves in this way with the token of their powers. So, hey, man, the, the mark of the beast, the RFID chip is a, 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 a stamp is a stamp that you're going to show that you serve Esau Edom, man. OK, and then I brought out that, that that's that stigma. OK, I brought out the 666 as well. OK, and what it meant. But you have to go into the etymology, man. You have to go into the the um, the, the, the stigma. OK, to, to understand what's going on. Okay, and you have to roll through the spirit, you know what I'm saying, to make sure you're in the the, the right area, man. You know, and that's why you got to go into these strong words, man. You got to go into these strong words to make sure you know what you're talking about, man. Um, let's go, let's go back. Um, because stigma and carox, if I'm not mistaken, are similar. All right, uh, Swanky. All right, and I didn't want this to be too long. I just want to be a real quick rebuke on this dude who don't know what the hell he's talking about, man. <laughs> who keeps coming up to the elders and still don't know what the hell he's talking about, man. Let's get the etymology to Karagma. Corrects, man. Okay, corrects. Part of speech masculine now. To sharpen to a point akin to um, Greek 1125 through the idea of scratching, right? Then the, um, the stigma say scratch, itch, uh, imprint, okay? Um, to sharpen to a point akin to Greek 1125 through the idea of scratching a stake, because they're going to use a stake to in, inject that chip in you. By implication, a palisade or rampart, military mound for circumvallation in a siege trench. Biblical use of a pale or stake, a palisade, palisade or rampart. Um, pales between which earth, stones, trees, and timbers are heaped and um, packed together. So when you um, uh, put in stones and stuff together, you use this like stake thing to keep it in one spot, man. For like trees and stuff and timber wood and stuff, man. So hey, they're going to use that stake and they're going to eject it in you. And they're going to eject it in you, man. To make sure it's, it's, it don't move, man. Once it get in your body, it's in your body, man. You can't take it out, man. Even if you are going to be able to take it out, the Lord still know he got angels watching you. And they're going to destroy you for that, man. The Lord going to destroy you for that. So, again, they're going to use a stake, a sharpened point, okay, 
to inject this RFID chip in you. The same way they're using that stake, that sharpen point to eject the jab in you, man. It's going to be the same with the um, Mark of the Beast, man. Except, hey, um, um, just like I was saying, you're going to have um, the whole world trying to go up against it. Whoever think they know what they think they know, they're going to be trying to go up against the Mark of the Beast too, man. And that's why it gets into those being beheaded, which are the Israelites, the elect, you know what I'm saying, men being beheaded for the testimony of Yahweh Shah, man. Okay? And then you're going to have a lot of the elect coming into the sheepfold during this time because they're not going to get the jab or the... Uh, Karagma either, man. Okay. Well, we all know what this this leading to, man. We all know is this leading to uh the Lord trying the ones he wants and just fully further blinding the ones that he don't care about, man. And do you want the people he don't care about? You think you got the mind, you think you got it, but you don't, man. All right, so Khan, Khan, I just wanted to bring it out. Lord willing, this is edifying that I ain't lose any one of y'all. Hey, because if you take from 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 the words of the Lord, hey, the Lord going to destroy you, man. Let's get there in Revelation 14, then I'll close out. He's talking about, he don't think that it's DXEOs and it adds up. No, I just told you what, 666, man, and I gave you the definition for it. So dude is bugged the hell out of his damn brain. Tell me some, the hands equal up to 666 or the hands are um some devil that the warlord, no. You you can get the you can get the, you can't get the jab <laughs> in your hands, man, or in your forehead, man. <laughs> but you can get the chip in your hands, in your toes, in your legs, in your anywhere you want it. You can get the chip, man. Brain, you can get it, man. Okay, so so let's let's let's. All right, and this is how you know those um the men they don't have the the uh, mark of exemption in their foreheads, man. Not the mark of the beast. People get this wrong too, um. Because the mark of exemption is Thawa, th okay? Okay, it's not Karagma. It's Thawa for the mark of exemption, man. Meaning the mark of, uh, uh, basically to be excused, okay? The mark to be covered and excused, not to be destroyed, okay? I just want to go down. All right, and I heard this is Revelation fourteen nine, and then the third angel followed them, saying with a loud voice, "If any man worship the beast in his image and receive his mark in his forehead or in his hand, the same shall drink of the wine of the wrath of Yahweh, which is poured out without mixture into the cup of his indignation, and he shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels and the presence of the Lamb, and the smoke of their torment ascended up for ever and ever, and they have no rest um, day nor night." Who worship the beast and his image. Who worship the what? The beast and his image. So that 66 is part of the beast's image, man. It's part of who he is. It's part of his system. It's part of him, man. Okay? And whosoever receiveth the mark of his name, which is Esau Edom, man. This is Esau Edom's New World Order. Esau Edom's Vax. It's like on um, Maxine. This is his uh, uh, jab that he's carrying out. And this is his RFID chip. This is his philosophy that you're worshiping. Okay? Here's the patience of the saints. Um, here's the patience of the saints. Here are they that keep the commandments of Yahweh and the faith in Yahweh Shah. Okay. Hey, because it said, um, and I heard a voice from heaven saying unto me, Right blessed are the dead which die in the Lord from henceforth. Yea, said the Spirit, that they may rest from their labors, and their works do follow them. So, hey, guess what? The labors of the saints, of the men of the Lord, okay, they follow us, man, because we out there on the highways and byways teaching the truth 100% under the elder apostles with great millstone. Not telling you that your hands add up to the the, the um 66 and that it's the hands and it's the right side and it's, and it's the feminine side. No, man. We telling you you can get a mark in either hand. You can get a mark in the back of your forehead, in the front of your forehead. You can get a mark in your um legs, man, your feet, man. Okay. You can get a mark anywhere, your private parts, man. That's how this, that's that's what the Lord was trying to tell us, man. When you read the, the revelation, man, he's telling you that, hey, if you worship this dude, I'm going to destroy you, man. It ain't about where you get the mark of the beast, man. It ain't about where you get the chip. It's about if you get it, man. <laughs> so, hey, Lord, when it's edifying to elect, I'm going to close out. I'm giving all praise, honor, glory to Yahweh. By Hashem, Yahweh Shah, by Hashem, Rakakodash. Double honors to the elder, apostle, elder, bishops of great must still be well. Peace and bless the hopeful elect. Shalom, shalom, wa'ababa, ba'ababa. Shalom, Israel.